FTC. Flight team stand up. We got Victor Wimbam, man, man. Hope I said your last name right. Hey, man. He's a man, man. He's been messing with FTC for I peeped the last two years, bro. He's finally in the big stakes. I think he's like one year away from going into uh, the NBA or something like that versus Scott Anderson, Henderson or whatever. Oh, Check it out. They are excited for this new home. So this is, a, uh, I think this is a French basketball league team. Yeah, I think he's taking out one route of some NBA players. Where they, uh, yeah, there it is. They have, they have like a G League or whatever. And then, uh, you know, they can go to the NBA after a year. Remember, brother, when Manya dude is literally fucking a 7-4, bro. He is 7-4, bro. This is a new generation. It ain't coming, dog. Literally, now, now I see why 2 did try to make these Demi Dow point guards. You know what I'm saying? I ain't going to lie. In a way, it is kind of a W for them to adapting, but they just need to tone it down in 23, man. We can all agree. Bring it up. Oh, bro, this dude is literally a glitch Demi Dow point guard. Stream sniper like in 2K. Oh, my gosh, bro. Like, I ain't going to lie to you, bro. 2K is going to be the most toxic. They think 2K is a toxic game right now. Imagine when this guy comes to the league and then he start having a lot of the player builds and the system going like that, bro. Sure it's crazy, dog. Yeah, I'm not sure Ralph was doing that at 18 years old. This man is 7 2 moving like he's 6 1. It's too easy, bro. It's kind of exciting seeing players as tall and fast. Back to oh, I would have blocked it if I was Maganya right there, bro, in my sleep. I don't know if he's trying to um, go too hard because you don't want to get injured in G League. But, yeah, you got to block that. In the NBA, they're going to get on you a lot about that. You know what I'm saying? We, we don't be blunt around here. You know what I'm saying? We don't mean yes, man. Always going to make people better. See, like, right there, you can't, you can't be afraid to jump. That's, that's an easy block. This guy, this this point. Ooh, come on, who is this, man? He's wearing my number from ninth grade, man. I would have did a better lamp animation in my sleep. No, I mean, yeah, that's number zero. Never mind, I thought it was number 11. Why do I like number 11, though, from this, that, that, that camera angle? Show the angles right there. When buying you do, I'm just chatting right now. Pull up! Man, he got it, bro. There's really no such thing as close enough. He can't even Imagine the NBA team's in a tank up. just to try and get him. Corey, that's not fair. It isn't. That's not fair. Who do you think is better, Shed or uh, Wembanya? Wow. Yeah. I think they're two different players, to be honest with you. I love this matchup. Yeah, see, that ain't going to lie to you. It ain't even a good look. You know what I'm saying? Defensively, because I'll do that same move on Wembanya, too. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but anyway, bro, you can't let a guard that's like six foot do that to you. You should just, you should just be pressing this guard here. Number five, you know what I'm saying? He should be knowing that in the NBA they're going to help defense this. You can't let this man actually like this being that tall. Because now his head's getting gassed up like he's doing something. This is the, this is the Scott Anderson, Henderson, dude. Who is he? Okay, here we go. Here we go. It's showtime. I like the emotion, okay. He's trying to go crazy for the cameras because they know Wabang is uh, the focused player right now. Uh, yeah, here we go again. Okay, break this play. Dunk pack is looking like a 90 what? The, the actor, eh, more like 82. The <laughs> he did the flight reaction. All right, maybe he gets more plus points with that. He gets a tad of saying dunk with that flight reaction. I like those. Uh, who is this Scott Anderson? Is it's, it's man, right? Really excited to be in. Obviously, we haven't seen last year. I Number last zero. Year, this is Scott Anderson. Got to work with go his handles a little bit. And, you know, he got a decent pull up a shot. Will he do this in the NBA? My bad, man. I got a hairball. Oh, hold on, hold on. We had to replay that. I had a hairball. That's a nice move right there. I'm not even going to lie. When Banya got literally 25 defense, bro. And I know he's going to probably see this. Bro, you got to literally get your defense up, bro. There's like You're literally almost 7-2, seven, 7-3. Seven, you know what I'm saying? I don't know if these are like the preseason games and stuff like that. Because you guys know basketball season's coming up together. This is the preseason. Then he gets a pass for this because you shouldn't be going that too hard in the preseason game. But this is actually like because the G League, if the season started and this game counts and everything like that regular season... Guy, bro, my guy, you gotta get your you gotta get your defense up. You gotta be a little bit more aggressive, bro. You know what I'm saying? You're almost Yao Ming's height. He's been the star tonight so far. He has an easy when Bonnie got an easy 95. That is a nice move. When Bonnie got an easy 95 defense. Um I mean 95 offense, but his defense right now from what I'm looking at is a 25, 22 if I'm you know what I'm saying. Uh, I'm on a bad day. So looking at me like it's gonna be okay. Yeah, you see what I'm saying? He got 95 offense, clear as day. 
what I'm saying? There's a lot of point guards who didn't even do that move in the NBA. He just needs to work in his defense, which is actually like, really like the less of the worries. That's a nice block. Oh, they call it go to? See, I'd rather him get those goal tins every time than just like literally like letting him go up with that layup or just giving ten percent effort. When Banya pulling up, oh, he's gonna be a problem. He found him too. Damn. Yeah, he's gonna be a problem. Damn, get that out of here. Oh, maybe his defense might go up to a forty-eight. A little bit. Yo, he's making that number fifty-one do like about five, two and a half. Man. I like that right there. Maybe his defense may have gone up to a 45. Eh? You know, I ain't okay. When Banya just gonna pull up. Sheesh! Damn! Nah, he's gonna be a problem in the league for sure. I ain't gonna lie to you. I feel like when he gets to the NBA, maybe like the first season he might get exposed defensively. And it's gonna be proven facts from what I'm saying in the vid. But he's gonna easily average a solid 20 plus points per game in his entire NBA career. See, right there, like right there. He, it, it literally like reminds me of like sometimes when I be playing 2K and shout out to my teammates at FTC squad, man. That be jumping in the paint way too much. Bro, there should have been no reason for you to jump right here. You can block this dude's shot without jumping just by putting your hands up like this. You know, I, you can easily tell the coaches that he's had in this corner just obviously yes, man. They probably looked at him like this. 7-3? You can shoot threes? You're on the team, brother. Defense? What's that? Straight up, bro. Like you, you know, you. This is just. This is literally fifth grade technique right here, bro. There should be no reason he's getting you with a casual bronze playmaking bags type of move. You know what I'm saying? Now, forgiven. It, it, you know, it is bad defense. He did got everybody beat. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and, and look at brother right here, number five. He just put his hands out. He just. <laughs> He didn't even give it. He just said like D. So I'm just look like playing defense. Anderson. You should not be jumping on that one, Banya. Just keep your hands up. You gotta have more discipline on defense. I'm more disciplined on defense than I sleep. See what I'm talking about, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you. This is nothing good. This isn't a good look. Like I said, this isn't best. I want him to get really good. There should be no reason why he's. They're both jumping. I don't know a lot of Scoot Anderson. This is his name Scott or Scoot. I didn't see that extra O. He can play. He can play. He can play. He can play. I'm not gonna lie to you. He looks like maybe like a Walmart Damian Lillard a little bit and like a uh, Maxi and maybe some uh, uh, who who else was I gonna put in there? Uh, what's his name? KPJ. Maybe a little skip to my Lou in there too. Yeah, he nice with it. Or maybe you could just say Walmart Damian Lillard or Steve Francis. If you got your NBA knowledge up there all the way. But hey, man, when Banya, man, you got 95 offense. You're going to be a star in the league. You know what I'm saying? Your only weakness right now is your defense. You don't even need to get your strength up. Just stop jumping. You know what I'm saying? And then jump more at the right times. And anybody that doesn't agree with me, you're just a yes man, and you're the problem in this generation when it comes to athletes developing themselves in all categories. There should be no reason why. Bro, this dude literally is technically 8 foot 5, bro. You know what I'm saying? There's some number of really that you can talk This is hidden facts. Right and I'm not even gonna lie, let the analysts, they're gonna probably be, be probably be on their hands and knees, not saying any type of flaws about him. See, this is an all-star move right here. There's literally two centers in the centers of power forwards in the NBA that can make this move. Anthony Davis, sometimes Joel and B, that's it. Because he doesn't have a strong base. So I like that well, shoulder shrug right there. The shoulder shrug is also on the defense, brother. Scoot dude. As these games don't he can play. I want to know his draft ranking. I want to know his draft ranking right now. He has he has potential. We're going to pay attention. This is the first time I heard about him. Nice passing. Number 10 needs to get his weight up. He got pushed around. He's about 6'10". I think his dreads is holding him down. He's getting pushed around. He barely got that layup off. Pulling up. This man is nice. But he has that Damian Lewis shot, bro. <laughs> we gotta pay attention to him, y'all. I'm very impressed. I'm actually very impressed. Because I'm looking at it like, who is this dude, Anders Henderson? Um, what a find from Henderson to Abogidi. We're gonna be calling that out a ton this season. Henderson. He's smooth. 
Wow. 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 Lombardi, what you got, my man? It's in a plus late game situation. That's nice. And it's proven faster that you know I have knowledge. He does not need to get his upper body strength up. He has it. This dude got pushed around to Madagascar. Somebody check on him, bro. He took the first class flight out of that court. Yo. <laughs> he almost broke his rib cage, man. Scoot Anderson. He got that. He's nice. He's nice. He's nice. Mbanya, pick and roll. Why is he open? That's going to be automatic. He has really clutch late game abilities too, which is a, a good sign. The screw dude. Oh! Defense, maybe got a 65. You're going up some overalls, though. Did he dunked on you, bro? You would have had to be canceled, bro. Well, I was wondering when Scoop was going to try Victor, and he does on this Damn. Position, that is advantage. You Victor play stupid games, you win stupid shot. prizes, bro. <laughs> he really thought. The rim all night, he really around. thought. Wimayama in on that possession. Wimbanya. Woo-wee! I'm not even gonna lie to you. This may be a stretch, bro. I think he high key is better than a cut ball already, bro. I'm gonna call it right now. He just needs to get his defense up. They said that's his fifth block of the night. Maybe I might need to shut up about his defense. Because they're making it look like from the highlights. You can't blame me. They're making it look like from the highlights that he can't play defense to somebody being almost eight foot. Five blocks in a game, not everybody's just getting that, bro. Not gonna lie to you. And what what, what, what these guys going to got going on right here, baby? Just that's the second time but, um, challenge him trying to shoot the jumper over. I ain't gonna lie to you. Maybe the stretch, say what you want. I'm saying what Bonnie do this better than a cup already, bro. Come on, a cup not making this shit, bro. He's not. He's just not. He can be wide open, bro. He's gonna hit the top of the backboard, bro. He's gonna hit a fan somewhere in the cheap seats. He, Wambanya right now is slightly better. Like, if I had been on a rating scale, Wambanya dude is like a 98, 97, and the Kunko is a 96. Fair. Facts. Nah, man. Look. Seven threes, 37 points? Who ended up winning that game? They got the highlights right here on the side. When you talk about a young man, Hold on, let's just skip to the end or something. And I think they said on the others from the video we were watching for the scoop dude had like 20 plus. Who ended up winning this game though? We literally went right to the right part of the park. I'm happy to see him up next. I'm like, bro, you didn't see him game winning. I think I clicked on the versus duel highlights and said, oh, this is kind of like a blowout. They won by about 25. Uh, Scoot's pretty good. Well, Banya's going to be a legend when he gets to the league, you guys.